Riding shotgun is moving to the back seat in the US Army Reserve and soldiers are going to be better off because of it. The Army Reserve is in the feeling process of receiving a weapon technology known as the Crows, allowing gunners to sit safely inside the vehicle. Crow stands for Common Remotely Operated Weapon Station. I love the fact that you have now removed uh, one of our fellow soldiers out of harm's way. Uh, they're inside the protection of the vehicle. Uh, they can still get 360 degree view by uh, traversing the turret left or right. So they're not up there in the turret with their head sticking up or their, their body sticking up uh, where the enemy snipers can engage them easier. Well, this is the uh, new gunner seat for the Crow system. I uh, used to be out the top there. They were all exposed to enemy gunfire, the weather and whatnot, and also rollovers. They usually end up killing or seriously injuring the gunner, but with this new system it's uh, a lot safer uh, for situations like that. Far from being a new technology to the Army, the Crows has been around in one form or another since 2001. This year, however, is the first time a major fielding program has focused specifically on the Army Reserve. In all, an estimated 27 companies will receive the Crows, accounting for $39 million worth of equipment at $190,000 each. Even though it is expensive, it's keeping our number one asset protected, which is our soldiers. It's bringing our brothers and sisters home at the end of their deployments. Before, when you're in the gunner's hatch, the truck's bouncing, you're bouncing, you're all over the place. It was harder to maintain a good target. Now with the new Crow system, not only are you safe inside the vehicle, you have a steady weapon system that you're using to engage the enemy. Oh, it's, it's uh, awesome. It's very, very accurate. Every time you pull the trigger, it goes to the same place. And the stabilization and everything, you can shoot on the move. Uh, thermal imaging, see at night, different temperatures, you can easily pick out targets, and tracking, leading, all that. It improves the MP's lethality by having various types of weapon mounting systems to mount while they're patrolling uh, and doing their duties in theater. One being the Mach 19, two the 240, three the 240 Bravo, and number four is the M2, the 50 cal. It's going to improve how we fight. It's going to improve on the amount of casualties that the Army takes. Our accuracy of finding the enemy. And that's the purpose of the M153 weapon station.